and reports right now about a boy, Cameron Telly, who drowned yesterday. And people are going mad about these reports right now. Yes, Arnie, and the Facebook page has just come to a lot of people's attention. The police have started their investigation on who this child Anonymous is. The page belongs to a child suspect who calls himself Anonymous. He is admitted to this tragic manslaughter. They believe the perpetrator was one of the victim's close friends and the crime was committed at around 2.37 a.m. across the street from the party in a pool. really sucks with that kid. Of course it does, Wayne, but that's life. This kid was at our school. He's been best friends with Jake since year one. Yeah, Jake's best friend, not ours. Best friend or not, we owe it to this kid to look at the Facebook page. I just find it hard to feel bad for this kid. I didn't even know him. I get that, but still, he he deserves this, okay? We're gonna right. look at it. Hey bro, did you hear about Cameron? Jake seems on edge. Yeah, it's been hard on him. So are we gonna check out this page or what? Let's go. I can't live with myself anymore. For the past year, I've been drinking apart. It's going wild. I didn't choose this lifestyle because I liked it. I chose it to fit in. It all started when Cameron and I jumped over the neighbor's fence. Carry on. Um, that was the end of the first post. So let's go to the next one. We sat talking next to the pool for a while. I was too drunk to remember what I said to him, but I do remember asking him. Mm. Breathing contest? Yeah, sure. Three, two, one. Breathing contest. Stop joking. What an ass. Come on, Dale, it's an accident. Yeah, but he brought it upon himself. But that's what makes it worse. Imagine how you would feel knowing you killed your own best friend, knowing you could do nothing about it. Would you even want to go on living? Probably not. Exactly. So show some empathy. This kid's just scared year nine, trying to figure out what to do next. Your brother's friends with Cam, right? Yeah, he'd come over a lot. I only spoke to him once, though. Mm. The principal called an assembly on Monday. He announced that Cameron died. I put on a brave face whilst walking to the bathroom stalls. I yelled even though my screams went unheard.
I looked into the mirror, and the person staring back wasn't me. Police came and interrogated our school today, questioning everyone who went to the party. I haven't been talking to many people recently. I was looking at my page, thousands of comments expressing so much hate, some even telling me to commit. Maybe I should. I can't live the rest of my life in guilt. Shit, Dangle! Did this kid commit? I had no idea that... that... That he felt this bad. Yeah. I guess. Do you take the pills? Shit, there's no more posts. Let's just hope for his sake that he just hasn't posted his next status yet. Yeah. Hey bro, how's it going? Um, have you seen the Facebook page about Cameron? You should really check it out. It's pretty intense. Um, but they say, um, the person who wrote the page commit, may have committed suicide. I should leave him alone. No, he, he, sh he should see. I know my brother. Okay. You guys don't know what it's like. Living with the guilt uh, of having killed someone. My best friend. Hey, there's another post. Dale? He's not dead. Thank God. <sighs> Who do you think this is worth for? Or you? Think twice. I can't handle the guilt anymore. I 